Glossophobia. What is it? Who has it? And if you have it, what can you do to get rid of it? Hi, I'm Dr. Sunny, and these are my bright ideas on public speaking. So what is glossophobia? The answer lies in the word itself. Glossa means tongue, and phobos means fear. So the word literally translates to a fear of speaking, or what you and I might recognize as stage fright. When you experience fear, your body makes a choice, a choice that Charles Darwin called the fight or flight response. Like a gazelle on the African plains being stalked by a lion, you can either fight or you can run away. And for most of us, giving a speech is so scary that we'd rather run away. Or at least that's what most Americans would do, according to a 2016 study by the National Institutes of Mental Health. They found that three out of four Americans suffer from speech anxiety, which means if you're afraid of public speaking, you're not alone. Most people are terrified of public speaking. Many people say they're afraid of having people looking at them. That's what Adele said when she was asked by Rolling Stone magazine about her stage fright. She said, I'm afraid of the audience. And stage fright isn't just something that affects pop stars performing in front of thousands of fans. I've seen it time and time again. Students are so afraid of speaking that they will drop out of the course and change majors just to have to avoid taking public speaking again. That's what happened to Warren Buffett once ranked one of the richest men in the world. When the successful billionaire was in college, he dropped out of public speaking rather than giving a speech. So I bet you're wondering, what's the secret to conquering your glossophobia? You don't have to be a billionaire or a pop star. In this video series, I'll help you understand the source of your public speaking anxiety and share bright ideas for becoming a more confident speaker. In the next video, find out why all anxiety is not the same and learn how to identify your anxiety so you can overcome your fears. I'm Dr. Sunny, and this has been one of my bright ideas for public speaking.